Back at the workbench again, this is a Blackstone uh, C19, another one I'll bring a bell into. I'll just show you how I'm, um, I'm doing the bell side of things there. I've done the bell at the back there, there it is there, so if I turn on F1, you've got the tsunami inside is uh, making the sound, and that'll be the bell motor to get the bell there that'll swing. I'll put a cow scale bell in here. So that's going to start to swing and I'll get the wire connected to it from this motor. Now that's too fast, it's out of sync, so we'll just stop that and we'll come over here into Dakota Pro and I'll change that in the uh, dimming brightness here. I've got it, I've got it set on um, constant dim. I'm using the pink wire from the FL4 TCS Dakota. That's on constant dim. Up here at the dimming brightness, I've got that at 8 at the moment, so we'll just change that back to, let's try about 6 might be right, put 6 in, write the changes, there we go, now we come back here again, and we'll see how that motor goes, should be slower, there we go, you can see that pin turning on that motor, forward, back, no, not quite right, so what we can do, we can adjust the Tsunami Bell ring rate, and we're going to adjust that one, so I'll just change that one back to uh, 7, I'll just try 7 on this, and see how we go, backspace, Seven. Right, the change. That's not too bad. Now that's that's on a um, on a dimming brightness of seven on constant constant dim. So uh, that's going to be the swing backwards and forwards just like a loco driver wheel just working a wire, an 8 hour wire that's going to come out the cabin going onto that bell and uh, just starting and stopping it I've also got the uh, front marker lights classifications on we press 6 mm, should be right, yep there's the markers on headlight the headlight comes on there and we can get that bell working. So that's how I'm doing the bell and how I'm adjusting the two Dakotas to match each other. Now I can change the ring rate of the Tsunami because that's got a, um, an adjustment between 1 and 15, fast to slow, and then I can match that using this motor, a little tiny motor that's going to go up inside the cabin here. So I'll be mounting that in there with a wire running out and I'll put the Dakota, the FL4 Dakota, beautiful little Dakota, I've used a lot of these now, up there. And I'm just, before I put things back together, I just put a um, 4.7K resistor that's in, um, with the surface mount LEDs that's in series with the um, LEDs at the front there for the class markers. So I experiment with the uh, resistor value, usually somewhere around about four to eight um, thousand ohms is pretty good for uh, these little surface mount 0401 LEDs that I've, um, I've put in and drill those out and put them in. Uh, that's, that bell's not too bad. You can see that little motor. And I'll be going in there working the bell. Anyhow, that's what I'm up to. Cheers.